Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Oh, so today I am going to be showing you my thrift haul. Um, one of my favorite hobbies is to go thrift shopping. I found some great deals. I found name brands. I found clothes with still the tags on it. You won't believe some of the things that you find. I typically go on either Thursdays where it's dollar day. So say for instance, they have a tag and it's yellow. Dollar. And that's every Thursday. I also go on half off a Saturday. So what it is, is every other week, typically on the first Saturday of the month, you get 50% off the whole store. So any item, it doesn't matter what it is. It doesn't matter the ticket price. You get 50% off. That's huge. I literally think that's huge. That's huge to me because I'm such a bargain shopper. I normally only even shop on the sale racks. If I go to regular stores like Target or Nordstrom's or the mall or anything like that, I'm so cheap, it's not even funny. I'm like, that's over $15, I can't budge. I can't spend it. Also, I've worn some of these clothes already, so I took the tags off, but I saved a few of them so I can tell you how much I paid for it. Long cardigan here. This is from Forever 21. This is the right tag. I paid $3.99, half of that. So technically I only paid $2. Next thing I got, which I love these so much. I've been wanting a pair of these. I've seen them like on people for wearing them on Instagram and stuff and I wasn't too sure how I would look in them just because I'm more curvy rather than like you know skinnier I guess you can say but I got these pants I love them it's really sad because they're a little bit big on me has these pockets here where it just has the line and then the front pocket is just the regular side they're more of a trouser they're cuffed on the bottom eight dollars and 29 cents so I basically spent four dollars and 13 cents like for pants and these were also they were dry cleaned had a dry cleaning tag on them so the person that donated them had gotten them clean beforehand also my cardigan that I got is from forever 21 my next item that I got I haven't worn this yet I wanted to show you guys I got this with the tag on it still this brand is it's hippie rose I'm not sure what store carries that but it is the softest throwover shirt I love these shirts like they're my absolute types of favorite shirts to wear this was going for $34 in the store and I got it for $8.99 and half off of that nine bucks got it for like three dollars so I wore this already and I took the tags off and I threw it away but this also, it's like another super soft sweater. I tried to go for a lot more neutral, so this is like a neutral purple, but at first I was like, purple's not really my color, looks good with my skin tone. Um, this is the brand Dreamers, and I wanna say I paid like $2.50 for this. And then in the neck, it has a cut, so it's more of like a V-neck shape, and at the bottom of here, it's fitted that I got is another article from Forever 21 article piece of clothing from Forever 21 and this is just like it's like a little workout hoodie but I don't know I don't think it's super cute so I haven't worn this one yet either but this is the front of it, it has just a zipper and it has the pocket the sleeves are cuffed and it has a cute hoodie with it and then it has the jawstring with the hoodie this was $5.99 and so I paid $2.50 for it from Forever 21. Like if you were to go buy this from Forever 21 right now, I'm sure you'd be spending $15. And Forever 21 it doesn't have the best quality, so I don't ever really want to pay full price for the items. But if you take care of them, they can last you a while. So if I'm buying it for $2.50, I'm okay with wearing it three times. This also had the full brand tags on it. This is a soft surroundings top. It's more of like a pajama top, but I figured if you wear it with like the right bottoms, like some leggings and you can do like super casual. It has pockets on both sides here, so I love that. The store had put it on sale for $80. It was originally selling for $108.95. I got it for $5. 
what that just shows you like what people get rid of like somebody bought this shirt tried it on didn't like it re didn't want to return it for some reason brought it to goodwill kept the tags on it still it was a hundred and eight dollars for five anybody that like hates on thrift stores or goodwill keep hating like leave it off for me that's all i gotta say and lastly i got this bag here super nice bag it's artificial leather so i'm for that because i don't really like wearing animal products for some reason i just don't like it it's vince camuto i was gonna use this as my like laptop bag it's on sale for seven dollars and 49 cents and i got that for half off but it's clear sure we'll be using this for my laptop i actually don't have a laptop case and funny story is is i went to goodwill probably like two three weeks before half off saturday and i saw this bag there and i was very hesitant because it wasn't half off i was like eight bucks i don't know how i feel about that but then i didn't know it was vince camuto till i actually got home with it and i saw it there still on half off saturday and i was like it must be a sign like i'm just gonna get this so i ended up buying it I paired my soft surroundings top with my leather leggings that I got from Nordstrom Rack and some cute black booties. I kept it a little bit more simple for this outfit. Next, I paired my trousers, the black and white ones, with a turtleneck that I got from my grandma and my pink Converse. I figured this was a super cute look, something simple also. I paired then the cardigan that I had thrifted also a lucky brand tank top some mom jeans and my cheetah print slip-ons love this outfit honestly with my soft sweater that's a v-neck i paired it with a box pant and a point sandal this is a little bit more fancier look for myself i love my box pants and i was thinking what am i going to pair this with for the forever 21 sport look i probably would just use this honestly to work out i paired it with my zella leggings and some workout shoes and threw my hair up for the last item it was my simple throw over shirt that i wore i kept it like really basic with some jeans and sandals and my glasses i'd probably wear this to school on an everyday basis then for the vince camuto bag i just put my laptop in it my charger and for fun, I threw in my Polaroid camera. You never know when you're gonna need that. Hey, thanks again, anybody that takes their time to watch my videos, I super appreciate it. Um, this channel is made for basically anything I have a passion on, so for thrifting, crafts, anything like that. So if any of you are interested in that, go ahead and give this a like, subscribe, do comment down below your thoughts. Um, if you've ever been to Goodwill's Half Off Saturday or Dollar Days, let me know. I wanna see what you guys get. It's one of my fortes. Everything I wear mainly is thrifted on sale or it's like dupe of something. So other than that, 